If peeing your pants is cool, consider me Miles Davis. What up TLDI, it's Jonathan here with the full review of the Miles Davis tribute in your headphones from Monster Cable, which pay homage to Miles himself and are specifically engineered for jazz. What? You don't like my jazz hands? Now because this is a tribute set, you're going to get some bonus items starting with the 50th anniversary Legacy Edition of Kind of Blue, which includes two CDs, one DVD, so you get about two hours of music, about an hour of video, and this alone is awesome if you're a Miles Davis fan. Next up, we have a slew of cases, carrying pouches, whatever you want to call them. Starting with this lightweight one, you just kind of pinch it open, pop the headphones on, and you're ready to go. Then we have a mid-range one, which is a little heavier duty, it's more of a button style, a little nicer in the side. And finally, we have the Miles Davis hard case, which is geared to look like his trumpet case. So really cool, it's got the limited edition number inside along with his signature, a little guy playing trumpet, and the monster logo. So very cool right here. Before we jump into the headphones, they also include a huge array of in-ear tips so you make sure to find the right size for your ears. Moving on to the main attraction headphones themselves, we're going to start on the bottom and work our way up. So with the right angle connector, it's gold plated, very nice quality, you get the Miles Davis signature right here. Now moving up to the actual headphone cable itself, this is probably one of the things I didn't like about these. For a headphone at this price, you would expect it to be a little bit thicker, so it was a little bit thin, kind of flimsy for my liking. Moving up, we got a little more Miles Davis bling, this is where it separates off into the two connectors, and right here you can adjust this to kind of fit these to your head. And lastly, moving up to the headphones, you guys can see these are very nicely detailed. We got the Monster logo left to right. We got Miles playing his trumpet along with the signature right there. These actually do feel a little heavier than any Monster headphones I've used in the past. So you can tell these are definitely higher build quality. Now as far as the sound goes, which obviously is the most important part about this review, I tested it out using the Apogee Duet 2 as the headphone amp. Threw in a little John Coltrane, Herbie Hancock, obviously some Miles Davis as well. And I gotta say for jazz, these things do sound awesome. I especially like the presence of the upright bass had a really nice smooth sound to it and the separation of instruments like saxophone bottom line is these are a little pricier than most people are willing to spend on headphones I was actually able to find these as low as 250 bucks on amazon.com so for that price if you're looking for a really nice set of in-ear headphones I would recommend picking them up you don't necessarily have to be a fan of miles or jazz but if you are that's an added bonus with all the content you get plus these sound great for jazz so hopefully you guys enjoyed this review I'll post a link in the description if you guys want to pick these up if you have any questions don't hesitate to shoot me one in the comments comment section or hit me up on Twitter at TLD today. I'm always on there so shoot me an at reply and I'll get back to you. Other than that feel free to subscribe and I'll catch you guys later.